Hey everyone and <laughs> Hey everyone and welcome to my first video ever. Hey guys, um so I got myself a pizza from Little Caesars porque let's do this. Let's do this little Q&A with y'all. Alright, so for starters you guys, since y'all don't know who the hell I am, I am Gabriel Roman, y'all. I am 24 years old, uh, born and raised in Denver, Colorado, and yeah, that's like the basicest information ever, but, but yeah, even though this is not my first video, you guys, but yeah, even though this is my first video, you guys, this is not the first time you guys see me. Of course, you guys see me from my boyfriend's um, previous YouTube videos, praying where he stays getting me up, but that's about it. And because we're here, we're starting, and we're getting back at you, baby. So stay tuned for that, you guys. But without any further ado, y'all, let's get started in this Q&A mukbang for y'all. I did go on Instagram and have you guys ask me questions. So excuse me if I'm like on my phone reading screenshots or whatever. Okay, but let's start over here. The first question that I have you guys is how it feels to be a Pisces. I mean, I guess that's a weird question, but I guess it's important for y'all to know I'm a Pisces, y'all. And Pisces are super chill people, super calm. Can I get a slice? <laughs> but I'm hungry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Have you haven't even started eating? I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know, don't mind me, boy. Mm. I have a plate. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah, y'all, how it feels to be a Pisces? I guess it feels. <laughs> I never seen it as a like bad thing. I mean, you're just a super chill person. You get along with most everybody, and yeah, like zero beef, zero drama model over here, y'all. Love that vibe. But yeah, that's how it feels to be a Pisces, I guess. Sure. <laughs> Next question I got you guys was, what's your favorite emoji to use? Or which emoji best describes your personality? Um, I have two, y'all. I have that one with the squinty eyes and that big ass smile. <laughs> that's I feel like that's my favorite one to use, and also kind of like my personality. The next one is gonna be the alien one because y'all, I stay zone the fuck out. Like <laughs> I stay dra daydreamy. Uh, oh, I'm gonna steal pizza. <laughs> mm -hmm. My bad, y'all. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're welcome, dude. Another question that I got asked y'all was, do you work out? You guys, does it look like I work out? <laughs> no, you guys, I actually don't really work out. I just started like about three weeks ago, like doing like push-ups and sit-ups at home just so I get in a workout routine because I do want to work out because, come on. But yeah, I really don't work out like that. Do you see you and Chris having kids and getting married? Honestly, you guys, yes. Chris and I, like, relationship is like literally something I was like, that's literally my soulmate. <laughs> Chris is literally my soulmate, you guys, like, he completes, he completes me and I feel like I complete him too, like, we're that, just that match. And of course, I want to spend the rest of my life with him and create little us running around everywhere. So yeah, of course. A lot of you guys got really disrespectful in here. Like, calm down, y'all. But... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. There we go. Ah. Ah. Give me a nap in there. Ah, uh, what question do you want? You guys asked me at what age did I start dating? My first real like really 
relationship was in elementary school. I'm dead. I, like my first relationship, y'all was like in elementary school. It was this little girl on that, and it was like funny. <laughs> yeah, if I like don't even remember that, but I only remember because like my mom would let us like call every night or whatever. It was like the stupidest, dumbest little thing ever. But yeah, that was my first relationship. I was like in. I was I would say like in third or fourth grade and then after that I don't have a memory of like any other relationship so I was like in middle school and stuff like I don't know but whatever y'all next question is when did you come out I came out um, back in 2016 I would say and my came out story was like really funny but that's another video because I'll tell you guys later but yeah it was like back in 2016 I was scared y'all I was scared. I was already graduated of high school and whatnot, but it is what it is. I live this life now and I love it. Another question that I have from y'all is what part of Mexico is your family from? My mom is from Chihuahua, you guys, and my dad is from Zacatecas. Yeah, Chihuahua and Zacatecas, the best states out there, honestly. Not for me, for anybody, but you know. <laughs> what is one of your goals? Sure, I have many y'all, but many, many goals. But I feel like the greatest goal that I have is to be able to take care of my family, y'all. Like, fully support my parents. Like, they deserve the world. That I, that's, I feel like that's my most important goal. Of course, I have many goals I have to get through to get to that point. But my ultimate goal is just being in a big ass house with my husband hopefully it's crazy y'all it will be crazy but with my husband crazy and my family being taken care of like that's my that's where i see myself in this future that's what i want my goal to like that's my goal i want to take care of my family fully and yeah um and someone said could you give my men tips because if i threw my ass all over social media i'd be dead <laughs> I'm dead, y'all. Oh, that's crazy, because I mean, it is hard to like, it's not hard, but it's like, what the fuck, you know? To have your significant other be out here like that, but at the end of the day, like, boy, be confident in yourself, trust who your partner is. Trust yourself, boy, like, who do you not, are you not like securing yourself to know what's yours and belongs to you like that? Just be secure by yourself. Like in my case, y'all, like I met Chris, and Chris was already doing this, like, I fell in love with him because of, like, this. Not like, specifically for, like, I fell in love with Chris because of his personality, how outgoing and crazy and how wild he is. And I can't take that away from him, so I'm not, like, insecure about it either or nothing. So, yeah, just be secure about it, yeah. Period. Yeah, that's it for today, yeah. Um, stay tuned for... More videos, you guys. This is exciting. Let's get it, y'all. Let's go. Let's launch this. So, with that being said, stay tuned for more videos, you guys, and see y'all later. <laughs>